What's up everybody, welcome to Finance with Fusco, my name is Keith and in today's video we're looking at how you can get some tips to save on packaging. To be fair, this channel I was only going to put videos up once every month, something like that. However, the first video I put on just sort of seemed to blow up and got nearly 7,000 views which is amazing for a first video on a first channel. So I thought I'd try and do some more regular videos. The other video that was on was the UGC stuff, that was for one of my photography video channels, so I uploaded on here because it's to do with finance as well to make some money, so that didn't perform as well, so we'll see how this one goes. So in this one here, I've got some packages and we're going to look into it, because this is an amazing tip, and possibly even life hack, to save money when packaging stuff and selling stuff. So if you can see in here, I've got some, uh, some padded envelopes, and these are no ordinary padded envelopes, these are B grade ones. So if you don't know what that is, that's uh, some of the padded envelopes may not adhere to standards that the suppliers are creating with them, so therefore they sell them on a cheaper rate. So we'll just go through some stats here. So as you can see here, I paid £45 for 1,500 envelopes, and that works out as three pence per envelope, which is an absolute bargain, considering that the sort of like for like equivalent on Amazon and other places like this, you can get a box of 100, and this box of 100 is £14.50. So that's £14.50 for 100, whereas we paid £45 for 1,500. So if you worked out the equivalent of the Amazon one and times it by 15 to make 1,500, it's £217.50 that I would have paid for that amount of envelopes, which is a saving of £172.50. And each padded envelope from the Amazon one would have been about 14.5 pence. So that's a massive saving, which is going to help you when you're packaging stuff up because the, the packaging supplies are so much cheaper this way than doing it the other way. And I know what you're thinking, how bad is B grade? Let's go out and have a look. So generally, what I've found with these is they are fine, apart from sometimes the inside. So as you can see here, if you can see properly, but the, uh, the padded section of it only starts, maybe it's a fingertip down. So there's a fingertip down missing the padding on this side here, on the underside, but all of it is still got padding on the inside. And you just have to remember that when you put stuff in, this little bit at the top, say thumb tip worth, that doesn't have any padding. But you can always just fold it over that much to cover that so that item is still full of a pattern. So the company do them in all different sizes. We've got some massive ones and I wanted some smaller ones so that when I'm shipping off some of my DVDs that I no longer want, they fit in there perfectly. So like I said, the DVD fits in, goes like so, package up, send it away. It's only three pence per envelope. So that's a handy little packaging hack for you. So there's a link in the description below for the eBay shop that I got them from. I'm sure you can find them other places on the internet as well. But this is the place that I normally get my envelopes from. Hope you enjoyed that. Hope you found it useful. And I'll hopefully be doing more videos like this in the near future. If you want something on the channel, let me know in the comments below. And I'll try and do my best to put that on. Until next time, see ya.